Indian economy will contract 10.3% in the financial year 2020-21 as the country gradually climbs out of the coronavirus-induced lockdown. The IMF in its World Economic Outlook report released on Tuesday said, This projection is substantially lower than the 4.5% degrowth predicted by the International Financial Institution back in June, indicating challenges to economic growth as the pandemic continues to spread and claim lives. Reliance Industries Limited has its eyes on smart electricity meter market after signing multi-billion dollar deals for Geo Platforms and Reliance Retail. Through its Geo Platforms business, the company wants to offer meter data, communication cards, telecom and cloud hosting services to power hosting companies also called Discoms. Coronavirus antibodies can last for at least three months following a person getting infected with SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID-19, according to two studies published in Science Immunology. Scientists from the University of Toronto and the Institute at Sinai Health used both blood samples and saliva from coronavirus patients to assess and compare antibody levels for over three months post the onset of the first symptom. This is also the first study to demonstrate that these antibodies can also be identified in saliva. Air quality in India's capital New Delhi deteriorated sharply yesterday as wind died down just as the burning of crop waste in fields sent smoke billowing across the north of the country. A smoggy haze settled over the city, reducing visibility significantly as the air quality index rose past 300 on a scale of 500, indicating very poor conditions that pose a risk of respiratory problems, according to the Central Pollution Control Board's guidance. India will have a vaccine for the novel coronavirus by early next year and it will possibly come from several sources, Union Health Minister Harsh Vardhan has said. In a meeting of the group of ministers, the health minister stated that expert groups are formulating strategies to plan on how to roll out the distribution of the COVID-19 vaccine in the country. The Central Drug Standard Control Organization has granted license for manufacturing of COVID-19 vaccine for preclinical test, examination and analysis to the seven manufacturers in India.